For the sake of security starting from May 30, 2022, Google no longer supports the use of third-party apps or devices which ask you to sign into your Google account using only your username and password except for Google Workspace or Google Cloud Identity customers. So you will not be able to turn on less secured app while using third-party apps or when you are working with your project. If you try to use your real email address with your real password while using SMTP authentication you will end up with error which says username and password not accepted. To overcome this error first you must turn on two-step verification of your email account. To turn on two-step verification go to myaccount.google.com and log in with your email. Then go to security. After that scroll down to two-step verification and follow the steps to turn on if it is turned off. After the two-step verification is turned on go to myaccount.google.com slash app passwords or press app passwords below two-step verification. Name your app as you wish. Let's say send email. Now when you press generate you will come up with auto-generated password. This password is the password of your email when you use that specific app. For example to send email from my website on localhost. I will be using my email address and the auto-generated password rather than using my actual password. After using my email with the auto-generated password in my code, I will no longer see the previous error. And also the email is successfully delivered. Thank you for your time and consider subscribing.